Thank you. Thank you very much, Ikem. And now we will have a vote of thanks given by Dr. Peter Emuche. Dr. Emuche, can you unmute yourself, sir? Thank you. All right. Can you hear me, please? Yes. Yes. OK. OK. I want to express <laughs> a profound gratitude to this level of service presentation in this night of songs. Our hearts are filled with joy that Azu, who had grown up with you people in the primary, uh, secondary school life, is being remembered at this stage of his transition. We are so happy and elated. And with this level of presentation, I can say with all boldness that our pains have been reduced by half. Our hearts have really been very heavy, but the words of consolation we've heard this night, these words have gone a long way to suit our pains and giving us a calm mind that the rest of the activities following coming week would be gracefully attended to. We are so grateful. And we say, since you have chosen to honor your former colleague, classmates, and which many of you have been communicating to his demise, that God in his infinite mercy will remember you. God will see every one of you successfully through this life journey. And not only seeing you through, that at the end of the day, that the time of exit of every one of you individually, you get this same level of commitment you have shown to our beloved brother, Azuwa Emuche. The Lord be with you. The Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. And above all, let it be that at the end of your journey in this life, you will also be welcome eternally in the bosom of the Lord. This I say on behalf of our matrak, Mama, Lady C. N. Muche, Ambassador OK, the rest of the Muches, both home and abroad, and to also thank the organizers of this program, the, the, the Central Working Committee that has given this befitting program to our hearing today. We say may almighty God bless you, keep you, and make your journey on earth extremely successful in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 Thank you very much. We appreciate that. God is good. Um, of course, now we thank everyone, you know, for your presence and participation. We're grateful. And of course, as you can see, the Emute family is also very grateful. Thank you very much. And now we're going to close our service. Of course, after the close, we'll have the um, GCU anthem uh, sung, and then we'll have more songs going on. And then also we'll have opportunity for other classmates and other people, GCU, mem GC, uh, GCU members, and maybe family friends who would like to, you know, have some words to give. We'll do that. But uh, before we get into that, the last thing we're going to do before that is closing prayers, which will be given by our own Reverend Adendo Anukwe.
Um, unmute yourself. Uh, oh. Dahi, unmute. Good. You're, you're on. Are we all bound to the solemnity of this occasion? Thank you for those of you who are wearing hats that have removed it. Exalted King of Glory, Adonai, you are the King of the universe. Nothing, nothing is difficult for you. For it is written that the earth is yours and the fullness thereof. It is written that once you have spoken unto what we have heard that all powers belong to you. You are God. Whatever is happening here today is not confusing to you. You are very, very aware. You are aware of the emotions and you are aware of all the Mahians gathered here today, both home and abroad. My Father, let your loving hands be on all of us. Like those who are crying, comfort those who are mourning, strengthen those who need strength. Father, provide according to your riches and glory all that will be required, materially, emotionally, and otherwise, for the easy transition of our mates. As in, he who we call was in them. Comfort the mother. Comfort the wife. Comfort the daughter. Comfort the brothers and the sisters. Comfort the warriors. My father, that on that same self there that he is going to be led in eternal rest. As a preacher man has said yesterday, when his house will be laid and we will see it no more. Let everything be in peace in Jesus' name. My Father, I regard of you. Azul lived a peaceful life. We had opportunities to meet him in different spheres of life. And at any time we meet him, his impact and his input upon us has been, it was positive. Father, receive him in your loving embrace in Jesus' name. As many as are gathered here today, some are in the nighttime in Nigeria and some are in the daytime in America and others so in the UK and all over the world. Even as we disperse and we go to our different places, Father, be thou the guardian and the guide. We give you glory for the beauty of this day. We thank you for what you have done today all the technical hitches, all that we are shortcomings, we took care of all of them. And today we have concluded this service of science in honor of Azuri Kemuche, because you so desired it. My father, somebody said here, and I concur with such a one, may we not meet like this again in Jesus' name. My father, my God, be glorified as men and, the, and your children have given their hearts and their lives to you this day by reason of the, of the, of the preaching of the, of the pastor of this day. Let the glory, all honor be yours and yours alone, even as the blessings remain with your children here on earth. In Jesus' mighty name we are praise. Amen. Amen. Very much. Thanks so much. Um, at this time, I would like to... At this time, I would like to invite uh, Chaika Ebizier to offer words. Ebizier. I don't want to start Thank talking first. Um, I met Emuche, Emuche A, um, in Omoa here, in Common College Omoa in 1972. Um, Emuche A, that's the way we were uh, called mm -hmm. in Omoa here. Uh, a stands for. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, he was in cousin's house, I was in schoolhouse. Uh, and because of the vagaries of time, I, I can't recollect whether we were in the same class because um, class one then had, um, I think there were five classes of class one. So I, I'm not quite sure we were in the same class or not. Um, Azuike stood out then because he was always impeccably dressed. And um, he was also the um, fag of the of our school captain then. Uh, in Umwahe, fag is somebody who helps 
a senior student, either a class five student, some lower six students, and some up and all upper six students. Um, so he was the fag of the uh, school captain, then of Krocha. Uh, in, in GCU, uh, um, um, well, the school captain, the school captain in, in government college in Wanha then um, was the top dog then, you know, he, he was in charge of everything. So, so that was a high profile position he had in his class one. Um, as a sign of his profile um, as a student uh, in our class three, I think, um, he was in charge of uh, feeding the whole school and Omwaha then I'm sure our population was uh, more than a thousand. So um, he, he had a, a position because of his, his um, profile in the class um, as, as, as a student then. Um, then um, um, I got to uh, socialize with Azuike in 1977 when we met up in Oweri. We were near neighbors in Shell Camp. Um, Azuike then was a proud occupier of his own room in the family's uh, boys' quarters, uh, a big thing at that age. Uh, and it became an important meeting and staging point for a few of us then. Azuike then left for IMT uh, uh, Enugu and um, we lost touch. I got reacquainted with Azuike when our class of 72 old boys group was formally launched. Um, this was our inaugural meeting hosted by Nweke uh, and the Jogu in Oweri. He supported our class group financially and got his mother to make a sizable donation to our group. To the best of my knowledge, the only one of our few surviving mothers to do this. Azuike had an open invitation to our class, to host our class in Azumini. We never got around to accepting that offer in his lifetime. As part of his jocular nature, he was prolific in posting light-hearted humor in our class WhatsApp page. His articulate presentation of political discourse was all too evident in all his postings. Azuike made it to the top hierarchy in NMPC. And uh, we spoke on the phone after his retirement and I did ask him about his plans going forward. Um, he was a staunch supporter of all things Omoahian. He happens to be a second generation Omoahian, a second generation his dad went to Omoahian and my dad too went to Government College Omoahian. Uh, it's a very sad day for all of us. Um, and as we bid Azuike goodbye, uh, um, especially his wife, his daughter, his elderly mother and siblings, we ask and we pray the Lord to give them the strength to bear his loss. Please, can the family of Emuche take hand? Though this is a journey, this is a journey he's embarking on now, and it's a journey that we'll all embark on sometime in our lives. There's never a right time. May his soul rest in perfect peace. Thank yeah. you. I would invite, um, oh, okay, uh, Stan, go ahead. Stan, unmute yourself, please. Thank you, Stan, go ahead. Uh, well, um, I'm thanking the class for a job well done. And I'm um, sending my condolences to the MHS, especially the old mom and the daughter, the wife, and his siblings. I've been close to the family for a very long time. And I can remember when I was about coming for, to Europe, that was in the year 1970. Eight, late 78, when I was looking for my, you know, I went to this UBA bank to pick my traveler's check. And I saw Dr. Emuche, I mean the father of Azo. I went and greeted him. I introduced myself, oh, he was very happy because he related a lot with my village inquiry. So we got talking. He said why I was there. I told him, look, I, I told him I was about going abroad. He said, okay, my son, I have nothing for you, but just take this check. 
they signed a check for me for some money to collect from the, from the cashier. I was very grateful. And me and the MHS from Achika, Azo, and Oke, we've been very good friends. And me and Azo, who were in the, and Oke, if I'm not mistaken, Oke, we're in the same house, cousin's house. And they are wonderful people. I cannot, everything we are talking about Azo, they have that in them. So the family, they are a great, they are a great family. So, and uh, that made me to be, to be very close to them. And each time I came home, I made it possible. Even the last time I came, I went to Azumini looking for any of the MHAs. That was 2012. I went to Azumini without knowing that Chuka has some problems with all these uh, bandits in, the, in, uh, in Azumini. So they did not allow me to see Chuka because I came with some uh, security details. Maybe they thought that I was, you know, so they gave me, you know, they, they didn't allow me to see Chica. Then I left and I dropped a note. But what I want to tell the family is, please, as we said from a particular uh, portion of, in the Bible, that we should, they shouldn't weep like those who don't have hope. There is hope. Because I know that he's sitting on the right side of God today. Amen. Azo has been a great friend and brother to us all. So we've given him that respect. And I want the family to please accept this little offer or, or this, this little presentation we've given to them. That is all I have to say. Thank you all. For, Thank you. For Thank you. Thank you.